Hey everybody, welcome back to Mutant Year Zero, Road to Eden. I'm Dan with No Games for Old Men, and last expedition went pretty well. We made it through the Cave of Fear, which to me sounds like a location in The Princess Bride, after the Cliffs of Insanity, the Fire Swamp, the Pits of Despair. And then we made it to the ferry boat, which is going to take us across the river to the House of Bones. Well, not is gonna, it did. Here we are. This is the new region, this lovely snowy area. And I feel like Hammond is right on our doorstep. So, a couple of things I want to do, though, before we get into the action. I want to try out Borman's Corpse Eater skill. This allows him to regain health by eating the corpses of his fallen foes. Sure, let's try that. To maximize his survivability, I'm going to swap out the snazzy visor, adorable as it is, for the explorer helm because that will eliminate critical hits. That'll hopefully keep him survivable a little bit longer. Uh, these other two don't have that ability, so I am going to use medkits on them because medkits uh, will heal you in full outside of combat. So before I get into trouble, uh, we're going to go ahead and do that. And, oh, she's got an empty item slot here, so let's... Let's make sure we've got... Things. Borman, you've got an empty item slot too, pal. And ducks, you're full. Wow, ducks likes the Molotovs. Okay. Am I, am I, am I good with... With her, this jump ability I haven't I haven't used. I kind of want to. I kind of want to see what this contortionist is like. So I'm going to swap that out too. Where low cover works, just as good as high cover. That sounds like fun. Okay. Let's uh, let's proceed here. Not really sure where I'm going. I guess I'll follow the path for now. I didn't catch what you were saying back there, Selma. Where was Hammond going? The House of Bones. We're almost there. And why, pray tell, do they call it the House of Bones? It's a big house full of dead people. Oh, fantastic. Borman, don't lie to me. You do not want to be doing this right now. What I want and what I need are two different things. We need to find Hammond. So shut up and get your head in the game. <sighs> Get your head in the game. You gotta get your, get your, get your, get your head in the game. Got a fence. Red Plague Protocol. Do not enter. Offenders will be shot on sight. If you are experiencing the following symptoms, report immediately to the quarantine area in Drongningatan. These Swedish names. Red blisters on skin, high body temperature, nerve spasms, paranoia, blood in eyes. If unable to reach this location, stay indoors and call 555-008-922 for assistance. Right. And an execution squad will be with you shortly. Oh. Okay, the fence appears to be... where I need to get through in some way, but let's check out the, the perimeter here and make sure there's no more bits. No more sparklies for me to pick up. You know, I picked up sparklies from The Secret of Nim, the Dom DeLuise character, Jeremy, the obnoxious crow. He's obsessed with sparklies, sparklies, because he wants to 
use the sparklies to attract a female crow and make a love nest. And that <laughs> he's he is my least favorite character of that movie, but for some reason that's where my brain went when I saw sparkly bits. There's a door here. Force open? Can I do it quietly? So cold up in these parts, I can't feel my beak. Yeah, I've never been this far north before. I feel cold oh. to the bone. Bunch of ambulances. Maybe this was a hospital? Now it's full of dead people. The House of Bones. I don't see anybody moving down there. Although I'm pretty sure I heard footsteps. Oh, there's a guy. Looks like he's carrying an axe, so it's probably a butcher. Hello, sir. Okay, so he's gonna go back and forth. And there's a campfire in that window, so there's probably people up there. That's a good bet. Alright, let's turn off the flashlight and go into sneaky mode. Because where there's one ghoul, there are others, I'm sure. Let's see if we can find them and pick them off one at a time. Oh, I see somebody there. That building there? The House of Bones. It was a fortress full of tiny flesh-eating monsters called Stu-Dens. <laughs> they came here every day to learn how to become bigger monsters. Where do you hear the story? I don't hear the story, I see the story. I went inside and I saw all these drawings of monsters and, and flying machines and, and gross stuff. Scary stuff. It was not a hospital. It was a school. Oh god, he's still coming. He's still coming. Get away. I haven't set up for your ambush yet. Okay, he stopped. Right there. But he's got what? 20 hit points? Oh, 12. Okay, so I can do... I can do 12. Oh, there's that guy. Uh, Alright. Let's, uh... Let's put Borman here. And ducks here. Oh no! Wow. He came way <laughs> too close. Oh boy. Okay. I didn't know that he came this far. Uh. That's going to be a problem if they both show up at the same time. He's all the way over there now, though. Where'd you go, bud? Are you coming back? Oh, oh. Yep, okay, here he comes. He's over there still, so hopefully we can finish this guy. Okay. Have not been spotted. Alright, we're gonna activate Selma. We are going to... shoot with the ancient pistol. Uh, I wish I had a better... better odds. Come on, get that shot. Yes! Okay, good, 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 good. 
Let's go with ducks next with his crossbow. Oh, I can't get the skull splitter yet. I've got one more kill before skull splitter re enables. Let's I guess we'll just go with this. Please get the crit. Nope. Okay. But he's only got two hit points left. So... Switch to the Needler and not make the same mistake I made earlier where I switched to the Gaper when I thought I was switching to the Needler. And we will shoot 100% chance to hit. And that... Enough. Is that. Man, that was my shot. Now we are going to this set up for this guy. House of Bones. See this symbol on the signs? Means danger. Hide. Hey, over here. What are you guys doing? They wouldn't he wouldn't hide behind that tree. Hide. There we go. That was weird. Um, is there any way I can get ducks in an elevated position where he can shoot? There's these rocks up here, but he can't actually get onto those. Oh well. Um, that is not at all where I wanted you to be, Duxy. Not at all. Let's put you there, you there. Borman, you're too far away, pal. Uh, what if... Oh, you know what? No, I don't want to risk it. I could use... Well... He could eat. It's kind of far away to go, though. Alright, that is as far away as I could possibly be. Activate. Switch to the Needler. Five percent. I think I want better odds than that. I could move him. Let's see, if I move him here, still seventy-five. That'll be that's a sprint. That'll be a hundred percent. Uh I think we'll just go from here. Good. All right. Ducks. Actually, let's let's go with Selma first. Hundred percent chance to hit. Excellent. Forty-five percent chance to crit. Let's see what happens. Oh, nice. Okay, now. Ducks doesn't have to use Skull Splitter because he's got a guaranteed kill right here. All right. Nighty night. Stone cold. Great. All right. Everybody needs to turn your flashlights off. Over here. Loot. And salute. Alright, there's somebody up there. Ooh, one, two, three. There's three people upstairs. At least. Oh boy. There's probably some people on the other side of the building too. What is that? A little gnat keeps hovering around my face.
Hello? Is there anybody else down here? Please. Scrap. Oh, it's a bird. Boy, am I jittery. Any movement Hell makes me almighty. jump. A mountain of body bags. This Ooh. is this is just horrible. Wow. Wow. Many, many body bags. Oh, they were digging a mass grave. Oh boy. Man, this guy just died right there in his right there in his excavator. Of the plague, or were they attacked? Holy ancient's power! Do you feel it? Let us now gather at the sacred site for the ritual sacrifice. The ritual sacrifice. All right, we got another butcher. Borman, I'm going to put you here. Ducks, still don't have any high ground for him. Um, 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 um. Alright, I'll put him there. And then her can be here, and I'll just start the action with her when that nice young man comes back. This kind of situation creates a really impressive level of tension. <laughs> like I'm right, I'm right here because I know that if if I if I goof this up, he's probably gonna call for reinforcements and then all hell's gonna break loose. All right, and ambush. I might have let that one go a little too far. All right, ancient pistol equipped. We're at really good range, 100%. And. Bip! Didn't get the crit. He has. Oh, he's out of range. Oh, wait. Pistol? Still out of range. Alright, so we need to move with him. 75% chance from here. Caught sneaking. All right. Good. Hit him. Excellent. And now ducks, again, don't need to use the skull splitter because we've got guaranteed right here. Nice. That bag of loot flips up. It's a nice little touch. Okay. Oh, I see somebody else patrolling in the back there. Wonder if I wanna. Why do you guys turn your flashlights on when you stand up again? This is a this is this is a dangerous area, folks. We need to be careful. Oh. That is just a river. And that goes back to... Nothing? Anybody, anything on this? Medkit? Medkit? Nope, no medkit. Uh, those are biohazard containers. I probably don't want a medkit out of those anyway. Likely to be contaminated. Let's 
So sad to think that during these disasters they were using a school as a triage. It's like that movie Outbreak from the 90s where the little town used a school as a makeshift hospital. Okay. I see that guy back there. How far does he come in this direction? Oh, scrap. Does he come this far? Oh my gosh, look how many people there are. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, one of them's a med bot too. I can see his skinny little waist. His little robot waist. Oh boy. Oh, he's coming. Oh yeah. Uh, you gonna keep coming? Or is that it? Is that as far as your patrol lets you go? Alright, what is he? Who are you? Oh, no, he's coming. He's coming. Uh, Alright, so I've got some little rock walls here. I've got this. Oh, he turned around. No, he didn't. Okay, wow, he comes all the way out here. A marauder. So he comes right by this tree, turns around and continues. Okay, so we could could like set up an ambush right here in this area. Um, we'll put maybe. The fallen machine did not contain the sacred numbers. Oh God! But fear not, my children. The machine led a stalker to us. A smart stalker whose mind holds the secrets we need! The smart stalker will show us where the sacred numbers are kept! The sacred numbers? Is this guy like a lottery aficionado? Sacrifice. So hopefully that's on Hammond. Hopefully we can resolve this situation and rescue Hammond if he's the sacrifice. Okay, here comes our buddy. And that's about as close as I'm willing to let him get. percent chance to hit. That's good. Can we get the crit? Nope. No crit. Borman. Uh, let's make sure we've got that needler. Another 100% chance to hit. Excellent. Pow. And now ducks with your crossbow. 75. Hmm. If I run right up into this dude's face... I'll get 100%. I'm willing to take that risk, even though he got caught sneaking. I still have time to get one shot off. Okay. <laughs> You're earning your scrap, kid. Follow me. Good, 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 good. All right, so that's four down. Let's see, we've got... Oh god, one, two, there's three, there were like three or four up in the building too. Man, this is brutal. Okay. 
Got some mutation points available. Nothing for ducks yet that I want to use. What's the running gun? Frog legs. Jump to any location within range? Wow. I want to boost her health though. She's pretty strong right now, but... Honestly... Uh, any... Any help. Any help we can get. Alright. Oops. Oh boy. Did any of these guys patrol? Alright, so there's a guy with a flowy coat. He walks around. Looks like everybody else just stands still. That guy up there on the far right, though. Maybe he's far enough away that I can pick him off without alerting the others? Or is that still too close? Boy, this music is effective at spooking me. Alright, so there's this campfire here that has... Yeah, he's just standing there. Not ready to not ready to do that yet. There's still people that, that are around the perimeters that I can take out. Maybe I'll come try to get him last. Okay, so if we can we use these stairs? They look kind of broken. Oh, there's a ladder here. Okay. I think we've taken care of everybody up front. Is anybody going to come this direction? I'll bet that's the... But we've got a new brother to deal with. Oh, we got some scrap here. Don't mind if I do. Okay, there's a guy downstairs here. A pyro in the window with 16 hit points. That is going to be tough. He's got a buddy with him, too. Shoot. Okay, here's this guy. Just hanging out. Alright, he's a marauder. 12 hit points. And he's just standing there. He's not patrolling. Oop. Okay, a little too close. Um, ducks. Selma. Does this thing count as cover? It does. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, look at this. Clock stopped at 2.03. In the morning or in the afternoon? Okay, I don't see anybody else walking around. I feel like I can probably take this guy. Famous last words. Get that crit, please. Nope, didn't get the crit. All right. 
Borman. Let us activate you, sir. And what do we got? 50. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No, no, no. We need to... What do we got? 75? Shoot. All right, ducks. Maybe, maybe it's time to use his skull splitter. Oh, well, no, maybe not. If I move him up to here, he'll get a 100% chance to hit. I'll take that. Even though we get caught sneaking. That had to okay. hurt. Didn't get the crit, which would have killed him. Okay, now, Borman. I can just move him right up here. And blast him as close as I can get. Okay, got the needler. And bip. Gotcha. Sweet takedown. Alright, everybody. Flashlights off. Uh, oh, what was that awareness zone there? Somebody downstairs or upstairs? Can we climb through the window? No, cannot climb through the window. A hand grenade. Man, I wish I could see, like I could move the camera, angle the camera down so I could see through this, but I guess if there was somebody there uh, I'd see their awareness zone. So I think we're safe. I think we're safe. Aww. A little playground. Okay, anybody hanging out over here in this area oh what is this oh that's a new area no okay not ready to go there yet we gotta rescue Hammond first oh there's the med bot oh you little you little expletive deleted is he near anybody can I take him quietly Sixteen hit points. Dang. That's a lot. I feel like I've been doing that much, though, with... with these guys. I just don't know, like... Ugh, can I do sixteen? And look at all this. One, two, all these guys... Oh boy, alright, I need to think about this. If I can take the med bot, that'll eliminate enemy healing. But I've got to do 16 points of damage. Which they're capable of if they hit all their shots. Which they've been doing. So that makes me nervous because they're due to miss. There's also some enemies that I just see skulking around in the shadows there, and I don't know if they are going to see the medbot fall. So this makes me very, very nervous. But... Maybe I just need to do it. Let's um let's split everybody up. Scouting ahead. How about that? Let's get him up here. Cause this looks like a pretty safe elevated position. There's no other walkways where another guy is gonna come up behind me. This appears to be it. And 
I've got an aerial shot at this guy, which is good for ducks. Do I have the things that... 20% critical chance from high ground. That's exactly what I want. Get him as close as we can here. And then her... Sneak around this way. Man, this makes me so nervous. <gasps> okay, yeah, that pyro right there. His awareness circle intersects the med bots. So if the med bot goes down, is is he gonna know it? Because if that happens, it, it, everything's gonna kick off, and that's exactly what I don't want. So then the next question is, do I go upstairs and try to get these guys that were up there? <laughs> this game... It's making me a little nervous Nelly. I really want to take out this medbot though. Okay, let's just... Let's just... Do it. Move her here. Ah, didn't get caught sneaking. Okay. Um, ancient pistol equipped. Oh, he's got two armor. I can't take it out in one round. Can I? And I feel like the, if I use the EMP grenade, that's going to cause noise. Oh, dang. Oh. Now I've done it. Personal injury confirmative. He's lying down again. Now I've done it. Oh, it feels so good. Come, filthy, filthy! Come here! As oh, good as dead! Wounded. <sighs> Darn it. I thought I could do that because when she moved into the position, she didn't get caught sneaking. All right, I need to douse this fire. Uh, first, let's move her uh, out of the way here. Oh boy, she can't. All right, I'll just put her over here. Shots on anybody? Butcher. Brother Skoog is right there. Oh, look at his head. It's all like pustules and stuff. Alright, what if she uses a grenade? That will damage all four of these guys. Three. Boom! 
Man, Brother Skoog has every hit point. Oh, man. This is a drag. I really wanted to... Oh, man. All right, I need to move him because he is in danger. So if I put him here, what is this? Is that cover of any kind? Brother. I really stepped in it now. I don't use moth wings. I haven't used that yet. So if I use moth wings, how do I? How do I use moth wings? I'm not sure I'm getting this. Invalid target out of reach. Doesn't seem like it's gonna be useful. Yeah, I don't see the benefit of that. Alright, let's get him over here so he's at least in some cover. And he's got a chance to disable this thing. Let's also use Skull Splitter. Didn't get the EMP blast, that's a shame. You, sir. Time to... Time to use the gaper. Actually, maybe it's time to feed. Where's the... That guy, was he over here? Where'd he go? Him? No available targets. Really? Okay. Alright, so maybe what I do, because it looks like the medbot's coming this direction for something. Let's actually move. Oh boy, that's that is not the cover that I thought it was gonna be. Rats. Alright, we'll just we'll just overwatch from here. Just do it. Just do it. Just do it. Okay, overwatch. Blast them. What? What? Use my power against them! Oh. Uh oh. Oh man. Need you. <sighs> Four. Wow, they sure do. I'm bleeding here. <laughs> wow. Medbot, how did he get all the way over here? Where is he going? Well, I can't waste time on him now. I've got a... Oh boy, I've got other things to do. Got no shot on Skoog. Alright, let's, let's, let's get her first. Like that. Ah, okay, let's. Will this be useful?
useful. Two there. Can only affect one there. Can only affect one there. There's what, two over here? I think. And the med bot over there is running off somewhere else. Alright, so this will be good because the butcher is going to move. So if I can do this... Yeah, I'm just going to do it. I'm going to hold the butcher in place. And then what about... Uh, that's not going to help anything. Well, what if I throw the smoke grenade up here where these guys are? Or down here? Nah, not yet. Not yet. She can't move. It's a terrible shot. There's no point in taking that shot. What I could do is move her here. She'll be in heavy cover. Does that set her up for... I mean, he's stuck. I've, I've trapped him there, so he can't move. My hope is... that... she can take out this butcher and then start plugging away at Scoob there. I don't know if it's going to work that way or not, though. Let's see. Can you get up here? Yeah. 75% chance to hit. I gotta take out Skook. I really do. What does he have in terms of grenades? What if I do this? If I do this... Okay. Now Selma will definitely be able to take out that butcher. You, sir, are on fire. Now can I use moth wings? Now does that make sense? What does that do? 100 percent 75%. I feel like that Exposes him to more shots. Well, he's already getting shot at by both of those guys. Can I use it to get up here? No. Well, let's just try it. Let's experiment. Okay. go for this guy, because if I can kill Skoog, that'll disable him. Oh, I could take out the med bot. Or not take him out, but what if I... Oh, I have to reload first. Okay, nope, 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 that's not, that's not gonna work. Alright, let's shoot for this guy here. Oh, they were due for a miss. Oh, and now he's in cover. Excellent. 
so it did sort of get him out of Give your mind to me. the way. Uh oh. Oh, that's not good. Totally insane. Uh, uh. You be best. He was behind a brick wall. to stand while I'm doing this though. Where does that put me? I can't I can't tell. Here? And does that take one turn or no oh, it uses both no time to die. We have to keep fighting. Not too shabby. Okay. Jeez. Not doing so hot here. Not doing so hot. Selma. Okay. You need to heal. But this is also our last med kit. Maximize my damage opportunities here. 50% chance to hit him. It really doesn't matter, does it? guys up here he's got he's gonna have a perfect firing line down into this area oh brother this is uh, turning into a cluster hmm point in using this on the pyro because he doesn't take damage from it I could get him with it but he's so vulnerable here can I bring him anywhere Bring him here. That eats up all of his movement. For now, but at least he'll be relatively protected compared to everybody else. Okay. Whoa. Free your mind, stalker! How is he able to do that and... Oh crap. Uh. Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. I'm bleeding here. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, Borman. <laughs> Let me switch to Borman. Can he do this? While this guy. <laughs> okay, good. Full health. And. 
Let's try the crossbow, because the crossbow still has that EMP opportunity. Could disable this guy. Now it's getting fun. Oh! Did it get him? It did. Okay. Selma? Jeez. We gotta get her out of here. She's on fire. Can she not walk? Is she... Oh, there we go. My mouse was way off. the fire with a smoke grenade. Okay, so she's not burning anymore. But... that tree hug ability. The med bot is completely disabled. So if I can take Borman and put him maybe here? I think that he can Eliminate this thing. Finally. Perfect. They've taken one of us. Okay. Good. One more kill and both of his abilities will replenish as well. But what's important here is that this is now active, so I can get all of these guys in one. Ooh, I should have moved her first. Uh, well, she's in smoke though, so maybe that'll. Ooh, actually, yeah. Actually, no. Let's let's leave her here so that the smoke continues to protect her. Okay. What do we have? Molotovs. No line of fire. That's a pyro. Uh, can it work over here? Uh, it won't get anybody though. do is start falling back making them come to us maybe I maybe that can maybe that'll work um, let's see those are half cover this tree is full cover but here. And then, don't have
have any more med kits, so I can't heal. Do I have a shot on anybody from here? No. Oh, because I have to reload. Single shot weapons. solid it looks like so he can't like shoot at me or drop something from below if I come here he'll have it looks like a 75% chance to hit is that Skoog over there or the pyro no shot on Skoog it looks like <laughs> I forgot that guy was on Overwatch. Pyro. Definitely want to take out this Pyro. Boy. Get him. Excellent. Alright, Selma is still under cover of the smoke. got an EMP grenade, which isn't going to do anything. I don't really want to move her, because if I do that, just to shoot... If I move her just to shoot, then that puts her in a really vulnerable position. But I need to do damage. She'll be out of range anyway. So what if I just start skirting her around over here? shot on anybody? No. Bummer. And he can't even get up here anyway. Cat Zooks. Can he throw? Oh, I don't have any frag grenades anymore. <sighs> he does have the chem. Which I think is supposed to give a bonus to hit. Can't get it there, though. And 
let's reload the gaper. So we're gonna need it in a minute. Shots on anybody. Gosh. Alright, so with ducks. Get the pyro if I get the if I get the crit. Only fifty percent chance though. What does he have in the terms of grenades? Molotov. Can you get that over there? No, can't throw that far. That's a shame. Look at that. I'm only like two two tiles shy. Oh boy. All right. Well, let's see if we can. 50-50 shot. I did Ooh, that. got him. What do you think about that, huh? Didn't get the crit though. Selma. chance to hit 50% chance to hit brother Skoog. I don't know. She's, yeah, she still just only got that EMP grenade. Oops. What if I move her again? Where else can I get her? Over here. Oh no! Oh. Idiot! And I'm out of med kits. Be able to shoot at the pyro that's up there. Overwatch. Because I'll bet you he's gonna shoot at me. Uh oh. Do you feel the darkness closing in? Ah, <sighs> boy.
<laughs> oh, brother. Is it an elevated position now? percent chance to hit brother Skook even though I'm above him and right there what if I move here 100% chance look at that just because I moved in the wrong spot Happy endings died with the ancient. 